feel amazing. Thank you very much. <laughs> it's really amazing to come back in Mexico every time. And I'm just thinking about the next time right now. <laughs> I didn't left, but I didn't leave. But I'm thinking about the next time. Um, when I heard first about Mexico, the first thing, well, telenovelas, because in my in my country we have a lot of telenovelas. So every telenovela showed me something uh, something beautiful about Mexico, about uh, Mexican women, about Mexican houses, Mexican food. So when I came here in Mexico, I just started to leave my own telenovela. <laughs> Well, it wasn't like that, actually. My mother was a singer, and my grandmother was a singer, my grandfather, they were, they were singer, singers in the church choir, and my mother, traditional music, so I kind of lead like that. I mean, I never said I want to be a singer. My whole life I was a singer since I was like that. It doesn't matter if I was singing for some few kids, and I was like, eh, 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 you know? Up, up for me, I was a singer. So, but the, but the first step was when I, when I met Plain Wind guys, my producers right now, and they made me a pop rock project, um, a kind of um, Katy Perry and maybe Pink, something combined. But it didn't work because that kind of music is really, is really different and too strong and you have to have a message and everything. Uh, maybe it wasn't the right music, maybe it wasn't the right lyrics, something. It didn't work. So we decided to do the pop rock, the, the, the dance project because they said it's going to work right now. The DJ will promote the songs, they will play it in the, in the clubs. And so you can, be, you can be huge, you can have a huge track. So they presented me Hot, the first, my first song. And I was a little bit like, in, I was just... I don't know, singing pop rock, like, I don't know, like, whoa, yeah, so that, that, you know? And I was just like, it was too beat, I mean, too, too fast. The tempo was, yeah. But I did it. I said, okay, I'm gonna do it. And we did it, I recorded, we put it on YouTube, and it was like a boom. I can say I'm a YouTube phenomenon, like, really, like, really promoted and. I was burned like that was burned like that. So. How do you feel to be part of this boom of dance music around the world? You're pretty much in the top ten of every country. I'm, I'm like happy. I really like dance music, and I, I like dance music because I, I can find my, my my inspiration in the public. So when you when you play in the clubs, it's, it's really different because you have, for example, tonight we have a big stage. I cannot touch the people, but I started singing in the clubs, so I, I understood everything about my public, about my fans, about the people who's coming to see me and to listen to my music. I touched them, I looked in their eyes, and I, I understood like what they want, they want party. And that's a really big part of my life and my career. Even though I'm singing on this big stage, I'm crying because I can't touch the people and I can't be in the club tonight. Uh, but I love it in the same time because we have nice lights, we have nice sound, we have the band, and it's it's really cool. Um, that's that that's a that's a point with dance music and, and that. And I'm happy to be a dance artist. But I'm happy to be a, the other kind of artist, like like top artist. I want to be a top artist. I'm working. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. Well, in Mexico, yeah. <laughs> in Mexico, yeah. I can say, whoa, that's the mic. I was like, what? what? I was here. It's like too soft. <laughs> um, yeah, I can say in some in some countries, yes. Um, I can say I'm a top artist, but I want to be there. Everywhere, I'm, I'm, this is my dream. <laughs> no, 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 no. It, it wasn't like that. No, because I, I was, I, I was always like, like, um, I like to to think the 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 truth about me and the 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 thing that I'm there. I'm in Romania. It's kind of hard to go there outside. 
to to present your your music and everything and I was kind of no I'm glad with this I want to sing there I want to sing there I'm cool I want to have a number one in my country um, and then I started to, to feel the taste and I said like why not I can do it more I can do it more I can do it more and even now I think I can do it more than this so <laughs> There are lots of artists, like like lots, like like I can say thousand artists. I I really appreciate from pop rock bands, from rock bands to dance, like very trends DJs or very minimal DJs. Um, but I really wish I'm I'm just trying to 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 get to make a song with DJ Afrojack right now because I really like and. I think this is going to happen, but when we have time, because we, we, both of us, we are touring around the world. So when I have time, he doesn't have time. So when he doesn't, it's like reverse. And I really want to have a, a song with him. It doesn't matter if on my album on, or on his album. Um, I like David Guetta. I like Black Eyed Peas. I like Will I Am. He's really talented. I, I like the way he talks about music. He, he knows a lot of things. I mean, it's really like amazing to watch him talking about. I like Rihanna. I appreciate Lady Gaga, um, Katy Perry, Beyonce. She is a star. <laughs> They're really nice. One day I want to be like them. <laughs> yeah, I hope. I'm working. They work, so they are there. If I'm working, yeah. If I'm not working, for sure I'm not going to be there. Well, I'm, I find my inspiration in my public. The music I do is especially for them. I'm not. I don't know if I ever uh, com compose a song about my love or about my feelings, like like something personal. No, I'm always talking about sexy girls, sexy boys, nice, happy music, party, clubs. That's that's the point for the moment. How would you define a club rocker? A club rocker. Me. Well, look at me, and you'll see the boss of the club rockers. <laughs> um, a person who likes the body, who likes my music, of course, um, and who can who can understand me. I mean, the, the energy. I don't know. It's it's about the energy and club music, dance music, happy music, like. Leave them, leave them there when you come in the club, just listen to the music and feel it, just like that. And what would be your message for your Mexican fans? I love you guys. <laughs> That's simple and I know everybody's saying that, but I'm saying it from my heart. I love you. <laughs>